day four or five-ish. Not sure how the sound quality is going to work on this. But we'll give it a shot. Behind my shoulder here is a beautiful, gorgeous lake Michigan. And in Michigan we have what we call singing sand. It's a little bit uh, different than a lot of sands around the world. You can't tell by looking at it. Indians were uh, the first people that were found here by my Dutch and German ancestors. A guy by the name of Mr. Ferry, F-E-R-R-Y, came to West Michigan um, and he was a hunter, trapper, and a lumberman. More than anything else, he was a lumberman. The Potawatomi, who uh, they were agricultural, very peaceful hunter, trappers themselves, a lot of deer here in Michigan. They had a saying that said that a squirrel could go from the upper peninsula of Michigan all the way to Ohio from tree to tree without ever touching the ground. Well, of course, Mr. Ferry and my ancestors kind of put a stop to that. You know, you, they kind of had to, right? But um, So they started to uh, decimate the forests. Over here, I'm not sure if you can see it. That's a, uh, that's a pier that we're headed out towards. But anyway, on the other side is a river called the Grand River. And the Grand River flows through a large portion of Michigan. So all up and down the river, they built lumber mills. And uh, West Michigan, Muskegon, um, Grand Haven, Ferrysburg, Spring Lake, uh, Holland. Um, you know, there was all a lot of uh, lumbering going on. Um, but, you know, the Potawatomi, they're not here anymore. Just like a lot of, uh, or almost all of the American Americans are now gone. You know, they're gone because they didn't have a very good uh, Department of Homeland Security, right? And they didn't know much about immigration customs enforcement. If they had, um, things would have been a lot different for us white guys. But uh, anyway, we had things to trade with them and, and we changed their way of life. And uh, we got them drunk and we gave them weapons. And uh, we basically shipped them off to different parts of the United States and kept them poor. Day two, 45-ish.